But first at six, the Macomb County prosecutor forced to release documents tied to raids at his home and office. They reveal Eric Smith is under investigation for possible embezzlement for crime forfeiture accounts that held almost $2 million. 7 Action News reporter Jim Kurtzner is digging into the documents Smith did not want you to see. We've been asking for weeks to get what are called return tabulations, what the state police listed they obtain in their raids with their target, Prosecutor Eric Smith. Smith has refused to provide them. He only is today because the judge ruled this morning they're public documents. Here's what Smith said to us last month. Why are you stonewalling on a FOIA no on the return any, tabulation on the questions? state police investigation? We've asked for it. The Macomb Daily has asked for it. You Frank Cusimano has asked for yeah, it. We, we don't no, we foia your office. You foia our office, you have to ask the state police. It's their investigation. You're the one who's not giving the documents. Sir, the state police have them. You can ask them. He said then he didn't have copies of them. He did and released them today. And take a look. State police in their search warrants outlined they were seeking all records and documents related to funds received from forfeitures dating back to 2011. In addition, the documents say any computers, cell phones, or digital storage devices will be taken to a qualified forensic computer examiner to search for and seize any and all records and documents related to the crime of embezzlement. Three floors of the prosecutor's office were raided on April 17th. State police expanded their investigation and also raided the prosecutor's home last month. We watched as police removed several security cameras on the outside of the house. The search warrant spelled out state police were seeking any and all security equipment paid for with public funds, as well as any other forfeiture records kept at the house. Sir, the state police have them. You can ask them. It's their why aren't, why aren't you and your office giving them? All right, well, anyone else? Eric Smith is not charged with any crime, but the investigation continues. These off-book bank accounts were discovered by county auditors last year. Forfeiture funds are now part of the county-wide accounting system. Jim Kurtzner, 7 Action News.